It had been three days since the incident. Cole's wounds healed enough to where he could finally leave the hospital. Everyone agreed that what had happened at the research facility was an accident. He had been told the college decided to condemn the building. I'll just need you to initial here, then sign and date here, she said, and you're free to go. I can change before I leave, right? Cole asked. I don't want to go out there with my ass hanging out. Oh yeah, take your time. The nurse left, so Cole grabbed the plastic bag with all his belongings and entered the restroom. He rummaged through his stuff. He pulled out the shirt and jeans he wore that day. The shirt was destroyed, but the jeans were okay. He would wear the jeans under his hospital gown until he got home. Back in the bag, he got his keys and wallet. Then he saw it. A small, metal square-shaped bottle with a twistable top. His flask. He picked it up and shook it. There was still some liquor inside. He opened it, putting it to his lips, but caught himself in the mirror. He stopped and poured the liquor down the drain. He tossed the flask in the trash, then cut the water on and washed his hands. When he bent over to wash his face, his reflection lingered in the mirror. The End The